y'all ever meet those people where you just be like minding your own business and then they come over and start talking to you and then they won't shut up bruh that shit be killing me bro like bitch you really came over to me and now you won't shut up I didn't even say nothing to you and you won't shut up talking to me bruh how does that make sense it's supposed to be the other way around that's really I've had somebody like that bro there's customers that come into my store and do that or God bro they will really sit there and tell you about their boating trip that that you're supposed to give a fuck about apparently like nigga you came in here for a coffee maker why are we talking about boats right now <laughs> or God nigga came in here for a coffee maker Asking me if we had a certain size or a certain color, and now we're talking about you, your your daughter's latest birth, cause she got five kids. Nigga, I don't care. I don't care. I'm trying to go home, bitch. Fuck you. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. They be like, yeah, my daughter just went to college, and you know she's just doing her thing out there. He like, bro, I don't give a fuck, man. Just get the shit that you came for and get the fuck out the store. <laughs> I understand, like, people be wanting to, like, share their experiences or just, like, talk because they're, like, in a good mood. But, like, bro, bruh, this shit happened to me today. I'm pretty sure that's that's the exact same thing. Bro, I'm in Chick-fil-A, right? One of my favorite spots to go to. If y'all ever want to get me something for my birthday, give me a Chick-fil-A gift card. I will use it for sure. Um... Chick-fil-A is fire. I don't care what nobody says. But, um, yeah, I was in Chick-fil-A on my lunch break, right? On my fucking lunch break. On my lunch break. Mind you, it's a 30-minute lunch break. So, Chick-fil-A. Uh, now, my where my store is located, it's located on, the like, one of the busiest streets in town. So, bruh. I, like to get there it takes like five minutes and the shit is literally like right across the street from my store so um <clears throat> you have to wait at two lights and then you have to like make a turn to get in there but yeah so i get in there the line is packed jam packed nigga and it's a thursday so and it's at lunchtime it's like at 12 o'clock so, like, their busiest hour. And niggas is walking in there. Now, alright. So, I walk in. I walk in because I have to. Obviously, I didn't want to wait in the, the fat-ass um, drive through line. That shit was long as shit, right? And I came through the wrong side. Because, you know, if anybody has seen, like, the two-entrance um, drive through Or not, like, a two-entrance drive through but you know how, like, a drive through will have, like, one entrance where everybody goes through? It's, like, connected to, like, the main road. And then the the other entrance that's, like, off in the corner somewhere. And, like, when you get to the front entrance, it's kind of like you're looking at the other cars that are going in like this. And you can kind of, like, hop in behind. Well, all the, it, the line was, like, coming out into the street. So there was, like, no way for me to get into the line, bruh. So I go inside, go inside, right? I'm thinking this is about to take like maybe two minutes to order my food real quick. Oh, a phantom just hit me, you bitch ass nigga. Anyways, um, so I go inside. I'm I'm trying to order. I get up there. Now, it is twelve o'clock, midday. Why the fuck do you have somebody? training in the middle of lunchtime they have somebody new training in the middle of lunchtime in the middle of lunchtime bro in the middle of lunchtime so that's two people on a register on one register on one register and the middle of fucking lunchtime bro so think about this so not only is she going slow the people and you know, people are, are on their own time. 
and their heads, they're on their own time. They're not on anybody else's or they're not thinking of anybody else's time, right? So, now mind you, they're, they're on the register. There's like 15 million people in the Chick-fil-A. Mind you, I just had a voice crack. Sorry about that. But there's like 15 people in the Chick-fil-A, bro. So, I, bro, this this didn't make any sense to me, bro. I'm standing in line. I'm looking at all the fucking niggas. They're looking back at me. We're making eye contact. Come on. I'm getting visibly frustrated here. Like, help me out. Nobody was trying to help me out. I'm going to tell you what happened. So, I'm in line. I'm waiting. This couple walks in in front of me, right? They, they get in there. They walk in, they they order their food, right? They're they're up there ordering. I'm right behind them, in line, everything. So I'm thinking it's gonna be like you know, quick little one minute, two minute order. No, bitch. You would have thought they were ordering for a whole fucking eight eight people family the way they was up there, bro. When I tell you I was so fu- I was getting so tight in that line, bro. I wanted to sock this nigga in the back of his head, bro. I, bro, I wanted to sock this nigga in the back of his head so bad, bro. Because I'm like, I know you see me back here, but this is the thing. This is the thing that really pissed me off. So they're ordering. They're taking their slow-ass time ordering, right? Then, then the nigga's like, oh, you guys have something new? Can you tell me what, can you tell me what, what it's about? No, nigga. How about you get the fuck out the line so I can go up and order my food and get the fuck out of here? The fuck? Bro. And they were literally... Bro, I swear. I swear. I hate couples. I want to beat them up. <clears throat> not not when I'm in a couple or not when I'm in a little relationship. But I be wanting to beat up other couples because, like, bro, they were literally standing in line and... Um, Literally, after they ask that dumbass question, she answers or whatever. Now, mind you, there's somebody training on the register. So, she's looking like, uh, to the other person. And then she obviously goes ahead on and tells them. But, bro, like, why are you asking this at the middle of lunchtime? Also, then, next thing they do, that really, that really got me tight. Oh, I, I have... This is the girlfriend. I have points on my, uh, can I use my points? Can, can you scan this under, so I get some points under this? Bro. My face went, it was already like, to now. Like, bro. Like, are you fucking serious? And then they're trying to do the cute couple shit. Oh, let me get it under my points. You sure you got more points? Oh, okay. Okay. No, bro. Get the fuck out the line, bro. I Get the fuck out the line, bro. Get the fuck out the line. Get Please get the fuck out the line, bro. Like, I've never wanted to punch somebody in the back of their head so much. Bro, I, like, literally was getting ready to, bro. Because, like, bro, why? You know it's lunchtime. You, you and me both know it's lunchtime. You can see the line that's visibly outside. Like, them niggas, is, they can look into the building. Like, the people in the drive-thru, they can look into the building. So I know you can see them fat-headed-ass niggas outside waiting on their food. And you see me behind you and another person waiting on my fucking food. And you're over here, oh, the points, the points. No, nigga, get the fuck out the line. Nigga, fuck your free food, bitch. The fuck? Get that shit another time, bro. Like, this is not the time for free food. For for your little rewards points. No, nigga, get out of the line. The fuck? It's lunchtime, bitch. I'm trying to go back to work. The fuck? I'm trying to go home, nigga. Oh, my God, bro. Like, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> bro, yes, bro. Milk bottle gets it. Hakai gets it, bro. Like, bro, why are you sitting there ordering like that, bro? Like, I don't understand. I, I really don't. I really don't. Bro, he had some blonde highlights, bro. I know I was going to get that sock off, bro. I, bro, I was going to punch the shit out of that nigga, bro. Or God. 
He's gonna catch this thumper special. But then again, if you think about the proximity, if I would have punched that nigga in the back of his head, it would have been a for sure thing. Y'all would have saw Gucci hype gets on. What the fuck? Okay, I don't know what just happened. What? 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 <laughs> I don't know when that happened. Uh, so I'm feeling like 50. 50. Too many men trying to get up with me.